Here are our five favorite workshop items for week 62 in no particular order. First, we have the Apparel of the Unending Wealth semi-set for the Little Alchemist created by Yi. It comes with three items including some robes, concoction, and crown. Keep in mind that this is only for the little guy sitting on the shoulders of the ogre. Either way, it's amazing and fits in with the theme perfectly. I would love to see this on a chained ogre. It would look like a king sitting on the back of his enslaved beast. Next is the Cloud Forged Battle Gear set for Skyrath Mage, created by Tidal Craftsman and Michael CTY. It comes with seven items, including a helm, mantle, bracers, girdle, staff, and two wings to choose from. Skyrath is a hero we don't see too often in games or the workshop. We're not sure why this is the case for the latter, since as you can tell in this set, a lot of things can be done with him. Also, according to the artists, they're looking for your opinion on which wing color fits best. Go ahead and tell them to use both! Third, we have Lion's Demonic Transformation, which is a singular item created by Dry. He actually created this at the TI3 workshop. It's an evolving headpiece for Lion. With each point that is put into his ultimate, his horns grow. This puts a new spin on this concept and we really like it. Be sure to let him know in the workshop whether you want him to create a set revolving around this headpiece. Next is the Guardian of Silence set for Silencer, created by Sebastian and Kass. It comes with six items, including some arms, a belt, blade, helmet, shield, and shoulders. As awesome as the concept art is, it is a bit misleading. It looks a lot more epic when you don't have to see Silencer's face in the mask. Either way, this is a very solid set. The belt in particular I like because of the book hanging on it that sports the icon of Silencer's third skill, Last Word. Last but not least is the Clash of Heroes 2 loading screen, created by the one and only Kunkka. We've never featured anything like this, and honestly there isn't even a loading screen option for when you're uploading workshop items. But after seeing this, there really should be. As you may or may not know, Kunkka is the one who made all the loading screens for the original Dota, and they were always epic. This loading screen depicts the lineups of both Alliance and Na'Vi in the epic Game 5 Grand Finals match at TI3. All I can really say is, Volvo, please add.